Hello, YouTube. Snow the Piper. Smoking a uh, Balkan mixture by Gawith and Hogarth. And my new to me, Peterson. Quarter Bend Bulldog. Zero S, I think it's the shape. Just got home. Changed my clothes. Thought I'd do my first episode of um, season three, episode one of Winter Sucks. As you can see by the colors, summer is gone. We're now in the fall. It snowed yesterday for a few minutes. It was terrible. Complete whiteout, but you can see the blue sky. It was kind of freaky. Man, I hate winter. Trying to get this bad boy going. School bus. Look at that. That's terrible. Everything's fucking dying. Apples are falling off the trees. All the cute little baby fawns look like deer now. Little deer. Mm. Thought I'd do another video. The other day I did. I did one all about the ongoings in Canada, which I usually don't do. I had not do with pipes, but I had to do it anyway. It was a big thing. So. Yeah, it's uh, <laughs> if you didn't watch my last video, I made sure I put in the title that it had nothing to do with pipes, but it's all about uh, legal cannabis, national legal cannabis. Where I live, the way they're doing it is every it's, it's uh, legal at a national level, but they're allowing each province to govern it themselves. So, here in Nova Scotia, our government decided to sell it at the government-controlled liquor stores. You can't, you don't buy liquor in a corner store, you gotta go to a special store. And they all work for the province. Anyway, first day, I think in my province there's a million, about a, a million people live here. Canada's not a big country as far as population goes, it's only like 35 million people maybe. And apparently about 34 million of them smoke pot. <laughs> um, it's been, it's been making big news kind of thing I guess, I was watching them. I got some friends from not around, you know, outside of Canada, and they're talking about it. And uh, I guess the way the way it was said is that uh, everybody's watching Canada today. Anyway, uh, where I live, there's about a million people. So the province uh, selling it to you know that many people, and apparently we did in the first day um, six hundred over just over six hundred and sixty thousand dollars in sales in the first uh, how long is it open? I don't know, 12 hours I guess I think there was 14 14 locations in Nova Scotia that were selling it and we made the government made 600 sold $660,000 and today's the third day and there's still lineups at the stores 
people are still waiting in line. So. Man, what a what a thing to invest in. There's a lot of people I've been watching. I don't usually watch that shit, but I'm watching the stocks of these companies and, and watching, you know, seeing who's on the board of directors and stuff like this. And man, you would be surprised. Um, these are all Canadian-owned companies, but investors are people from um, like foreign investors. You know, I guess that's kind of normal though, anyway, but. One of the bigger companies uh, that manufacture this shit. I think in the board of directors, it was like a, a congressman from the United States, um, ex prime minister of Canada, and some other guy from the States. I know there's a lot of big, big uh, American, big headed Americans, like not big head, big American heads of shit, you know, like government officials. Um, CEOs of huge companies and shit like that investing in marijuana production in Canada. Anyway, we're not gonna talk about that because it's a pipe video. It's just a, that was just a summary of my last video. Where's the time at here? All right, because this is all about Winter Sucks Park, fucking whatever. This pipe, I've been, I really like it. It doesn't uh, surprisingly does not gurgle. Like I. This is my fourth Peterson, not, and like I say, it's not that I'm a Peterson fanboy, it's just that my local B&M has a lot of Petersons. It just happened to, like I say, it's, I said that before, it's like a lot of Petersons and a lot of Brigham's. Those are the, the names that catch my eye. Like I asked them, I said, um, I really want to get a Savinelli, oh fuck, I forget the shape. It's kind of shaped like this. It's a three-quarter bend, and it's got the big egg-shaped bowl or squash tomato. Um, a three-something, I think. 320, maybe? I don't know. I really like that shape, so I keep asking about Savinelli's. And I showed him the shape. And the guy that I talked to, the guy that sees me in there, he recognizes me, and he knows that I like... He knows my taste of pipes. And they've got like a lot of cool shit in there. They bring out these old places. Hundred the the B and M's 150 years old. Like the t the company, the tobacco shop is 150 years old. And he's the I think like I said it before. I think he's the fourth generation. It's called Seaverts Tobacco. Anyway, it's uh, it's really cool, and it's uh. I wonder if I could share their Facebook page on Instagram. I have to see if they're on Instagram. I'm trying to use Instagram a bit more. I'm learning. I'm just figuring out hashtags. Um, but yeah, I tried to get them to bring in some Seven Ellies. I'm going to do in the winter. I won't smoke this in my house because it stinks out your house. I don't smoke in my house. Okay, there's one thing, is this time of year when the air is chilly, like this morning it was only, uh, when I left the house this morning, I think it was minus one, it's about, let's see over there, I think the last time I checked it's at six degrees outside. Look at the light switch, man, just the other day it was, you know, in the 30s. And then uh, someone flicked the light switch and this happened. You know, I got a jacket on, man, you know, I got long pants. Hate it. But this time of year, the tobacco tastes really good. In the cooler air. When I smoked cigarettes years ago, I always enjoyed smoking cigarettes in the cool air. 
but a coffee. Man, I love smoke. I love drinking coffee and smoking cigarettes. But I've already had my coffee limit for the day. I gotta watch. I gotta watch the coffee. I'm drinking so much coffee, it's fucking up my toe. Yes, I'm drinking so much coffee, it's fucking up my toe. I know that sounds stupid. Oh look, legal fucking weed in Canada, and here's freaking Tim going on about, you know, too much coffee fucks his toe up. No, it has nothing to do with it. Gout. I ended up with the gout. A couple of attacks this year. And this is the most coffee I ever drank in my life. So I'm limiting my coffee intake. Staying away from them dirty old sausages and shit like that. Pounding the water to me. It's a little harder this time of year to get the water in you because I don't sweat like a friggin' pig like I usually do. Now I just sweat. But yeah, the tobacco tastes really good this time of year. Now, I did get a little appreciation for Virginia's. I'm still, you know, getting a little fad for, you know, a few bowls a week or two. I might enjoy Virginia's. Not all the time, but I can enjoy Virginia's for like a two week period. Then it's just, no, I gotta smoke English. Right now, I, just, I, I think I like aromatics better than English's. I really do. Or, I mean, uh, aromatics more than uh, uh, Virginia's. But everybody says, you know, you smoke your Virginia's when it's cold. And you smoke your... Or sorry, you smoke your Virginia's when it's warm. And you smoke your English just when it's cold. And, you know, where we have such a great variation in temperature over the seasons, it's a good test because I'll be, you know, I can be outside minus 10, minus 20 smoking a pipe. Then it can be like, you know, 35 degrees on the most side smoking a pipe to six months later. So... It's good to see. It doesn't really work like that. Our cold months are probably January, February, March. February's brutal. And then we get the nice days are usually in August. Hot days. Freaking leaves all over the place. Jesus. It's a good smoking pipe. It doesn't gurgle a lot. I put my hand up to see the timer. So you can see the friggin' sunbeams, man. Anyway, that's enough of this. Thanks for watching uh, my shitty, boring episode of Winter Sucks Season 3, Episode Friggin' 1. Maybe Episode 0.5. This would be the beta. Anyway, thanks for watching. There you go.